First of all, happy Thanksgiving, y'all. This is like a pretty weird video because it's late. I was literally about to fall. I was laying down, going to sleep, and God dropped, started speaking, dropped this word in my spirit. And I just thought, okay, get up and start speaking because I was going to try and hold it to the morning. But I need to get this out right now for whatever reason. But I was just thinking, um, hair wise, I'm thinking about what I do as far as hair. And the other day, a few people just. A surge of kind of like comments were coming in saying like you know I've been using your tips and my hair has changed so much or like I'm seeing the progress and those type of comments and I think it they've been sticking with me because I hadn't realized until those comments were made the other day that I don't you know me as an influencer and I'm sure other people you don't really get those too often but that's why we do what we do so like when I post a picture of my hair it's like um, compliments about my hair which are really great and really encouraging but it's those comments about someone telling me how what I do has actually helped make a change in their lives has actually helped make a change in their hair journey so this is hair this is where I started thinking and I started thinking about this and applying it to our life like how I wear my hair people come to my page and they trust me as a source because they see my hair it's it speaks for itself like oh it's growing it's healthy i want to know what she's doing and so when you apply that to your life and you see someone's life and you see them they might be going through stuff but they're getting through it they're you you know they might have been in one situation one year but the next year they're in a different place they're doing much better they're growing they're they're go moving forward like their life is just like wow how do they do that like i need to know what you're doing and what is the secret and so i'm thinking about how we live our life for god I want to live that type of life and I encourage y'all to consider this and think about like what is your life how are you living it like will people does it speak for itself will people look at it and be like okay I need to know what she's doing I need to know what he doing and then you have the opportunity to tell them is God you know let me tell you how I get by every day because of God let me tell you how I'm able to keep my face together keep my keep myself together despite everything that's going on wrong around me because I have God and he's the one that's pushing me through so how are you living your life is what I want to ask you and another thing I thought of too is why I probably don't see those comments so often and I think about it what I want to do with hair so let's take it back to hair what I want to do with hair is I want to give you the tools and teach you how you can have your hair healthy and grow your hair because I can't grow anyone's hair for them I can't do it for you you got to want to do it yourself and so that's the thing with life too when we come across someone who might be struggling they might want that light that you have in you I can't make you love God for I mean, like I can't love God for you or I can't live a life for God for you I could I could drop seeds I can I could tell you what works for me and I could tell you that it's God but now you you got to get on me you got to get to know him for yourself now you know like my relationship with God is my relationship and I can just encourage you to have your own relationship with God because of how my relationship with him has manifested within my life and so that's what it is I I, I saw this um thing it said that a prophet's job is not to get a person to try or it's not to get a person to start relying on their word and how they hear their word but how they hear God's word so when this is something I, I actually did not understand a lot a lot of people come to me for like advice like life advice and me wanting to help I always want to help and it's like okay I'm always trying to figure okay God what are you trying to say to this person and then really recently I'm realizing like lady you don't have to always have the answers sometimes it's so simple as you need to refer them straight always right back to God you know what have you prayed about it um, do you know what God has said about it my job as someone who gives advice is not or teaches whatever minutes is not to get people to rely on me or to think that I have the answers because I don't the answers I get are from him and you can get those same answers with the direct relationship with him I don't want you to rely on me I want to encourage you to rely on him so while people you know if you think like anyone you can think of in your life that you go to for answers they seem like you know uh, that that is not it's not their job to get you to become dependent on them it's their job to refer you to what is helping them so with hair 
I can't do your hair for me. It's not that's not my job. But what I'm trying to do is give you the answers so that you don't have to come back to me. What I'm trying to do is get to get you to know the little bit that I do know so that you don't have to come back to me that you now you know from from that here on out you know you can just go straight to God because you realize from me oh it's God that she's getting this from it's got and, and you can get that too and so it's the same thing with hair and that's what brought me there because it's like with hair I just got to give you the tips and the tools and you don't you don't really got to come to my page anymore you don't really have, that's the thing with my hair thing is like I want to teach people so well with their hair that they probably don't really need my videos anymore because you know your own hair so well at this point. I want to give equip you enough so that you know you you don't have to come to me. You have the tools. So in my life, I, if you see my life, I want to live a life where you can say like, okay, she got something. What does she got? And I can tell you what I got and that's God. But that's not to let you come back to me. It's to encourage you to get that same thing that I got. So I don't, I hope that I'm getting this through, but that's really what I want to get is live your life in a way that it speaks for itself. If we compare this to hair, people come to me because my hair, obviously they see it's growing and they want to know what is she doing? Live your life in a way that people can see and they're like, okay, I need to know what they're doing. And also understand that you cannot make someone do these things that you're letting them know about like oh, okay it's God I pray da 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 you can't make them start praying and all that stuff they have to want that on their own with hair I can't make you I can't make your hair healthy so some people will listen to all the things I gotta say about hair and will still struggle with their hair but they have to really want it themselves and to really take in what I give out about hair they have to want a relationship with God themselves and really take in what I say about God that's the only thing that's going to make the difference and god is going to likewise god is going to grow them no one else can cause them to grow you can only plant the seed but he's the only one that will cause them to grow so i whatever you picked up from it whatever you picked up from what i just said but there's just a few things just to remember like you're doing this not to get people to rely on you you're doing this so that they can be equipped and to, you're trying to lead them to God who is the one that's been helping you and also as far as the people who have been commenting come back like that really encouraged me like that I'm like this is really why I do this is so that people can actually see a change in their hair not so people can come and compliment me not so like I I feel most uh, like I'm doing what I should be doing as far as like my purpose here on my instagram all that stuff whether it's for hair or whatever is to help people embrace their hair and learn about the hair but it's like very few people come back to me about that and so when they do it's like yes like okay like what i put out really does help still and so it encourages me just to keep going because if i if i'm doing what i'm doing and i don't ever know like are people actually are these tips actually helping I could get a little discouraged so if you have someone in mind like not even just about hair in your life or someone might have said something and the planted a seed in you and you you pick that up and you started incorporating it into your life and it's made changes for you if someone has come to mind while I'm, I'm speaking about this think about sending them a quick text like hey you know this may be a little random but I just was thinking about you and I wanted to let you know uh, when I first met you, da 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 da, or you know, like at this meeting, that you know, you said something that really stuck with me, and I've been in stuff like that. Like, just let people know it really encourages them to let them know that they're doing what God is telling them to do and that God is using them. So, encourage somebody today and stay encouraged. Like, live the life that you that where people can look at you and get from you what might help them make a change in their life. So Happy Thanksgiving, y'all. Stay encouraged. I hope this was <laughs> something that you were able to take something from and understand. But good night.